Hi, I'm the 13th Wolfman, and uh, this is my contest entry for 31 Film Talk. 31 Film Talk has asked us to do five things and ask five questions, answer five questions, and possibly do a bonus thing. And the five questions are, give a shout. The first one is, can you give a shout out? And you got to give a shout out to someone that you don't already know, that you haven't already given a shout out to in the past. Okay, easy enough. My shout out is to 31 Film Talk. I know I haven't given them a shout out in the past, uh, or talked about him in the past videos. I love his, I, I, I just started watching more of his stuff lately. He is very knowledgeable, he knows, he knows what he's talking about, he loves his movies. So my shout out is to you. I know that sounds like a brown nosing, but I'm not, because the next thing it was to, he wants to know us how I found out about 31 Film Talk. Well, uh, 31 Film Talk and myself are a part of a group of reviewers on the, on the internet website, The Dorkany. It's a hub where all the reviewers can, you know, kind of get together and put their stuff put their stuff on this, I guess that's a hub, really, put their stuff on this hub, and it, they're not taking the views away from YouTube, it's actually a click-through, if you want it, you click on it, and we're still getting the review, we're still getting the, uh, the viewers, and the views, but you get to see it more than one place, and it helps us out, it helps you out, so, he's actually on there, I've seen his, I've seen his little avatar next to mine a few times, so that's how I found 31 Film Talk. Oldest movie I own? I have The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari and I have Nosferatu. And I'm not sure which one came first. So I'm going to say both. Um, I, think the doc, I think The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari came before Nosferatu. But I'm not quite sure. But I'm, I'll say The Cabinet of Dr. Caligari. Now, if you're talking about, you know, talkies, you know, you're going down to see the talkies, you know, the people that went to see those. Um, it would be Dracula, came out in 1931. It would be Frankenstein, that came out in 1931, you know. Uh, I'm, I'm on the horror side of that fence, so. Uh, next question was, first Blu-ray. I bought three. Uh, the Lost Boys. Return of the Living Dead and Dawn of the Dead, all on Blu-ray. I have I had them all on DVD, but I was like, well, I get the ones I thought maybe I'll get the ones that I know first. That way, if I could, I can watch them on DVD and I can compare them to the Blu-ray and really see if Blu-ray is worth investing in. Well, three years later, I have an addiction to blue now. So, yeah. Blu-ray's worth investing in. Next question was, Star Wars or Star Trek? I say both. I'm not going to choose. I'm sorry. You can ask that question to anybody else. They, they might choose Star Wars because it's this, and some people might choose Star Trek because it's that. But honestly, honestly, no, I'm not going to choose. I like Star Trek. Star Trek is nothing more than a Western, where they're trekking along in space, they're they're out on the high plains, and they're coming, they're coming along other people, and they're getting themselves into situations. Now, old Captain Kirk, Captain Kirk's got to get them out, you know. But uh, then you got Star, you know, you got Star Wars. Star Wars is Shakespeare. You know, it's Shakespeare. It's an opera of six parts, if you if you will. And I like that. I like the way the stories are set up there, too. So, to me, it's both. Sorry, I'm not going to choose. Last thing he wants us to do is sing, you know, for a bonus, if we want, sing a Disney song. And I don't know a lot of Disney songs all the way through. I know, like, the little catchphrases, you know. Uh, do you want to build a snowman? You know. Uh... Super califragilisticexpialidocious. If you say it fast enough, it sounds like quite atrocious. You know, uh, a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. See, I know that. I don't know the words, so I hope that's enough for you. I'm the 13th Wolfman. I'm on the prowl.